Hey guys, welcome to my channel once again. If you want to see how I achieved this look, then keep on watching. Alright, so at this point, I'm just going to be showing you guys what I'm going to be using to moisturize. Just the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner. It's my favorite stuff. So to begin, I'm just going to be parting my hair directly down the center. I'm not parting it perfect, but you get the idea. Alright, so at this point, I'm just sectioning off my hair. I'm just um, getting a little bit and putting away the hair that I won't be starting with, and I'm gonna start braiding. Right. So now I'm just adding some of that moisturizer that I showed you at the beginning of the video to the ends of this section, um, just so that I can get some moisture into it. It is a practice style, so you want to make sure your hair gets moisturized. And then after that, I'm gonna be using my Hicks. Um, edge control. It's pretty good edge control. Just to stick down the edges so that um, my hair can look nice and sleek and neat. So now I'm just adding some um, Eco Cellar Gel just to my hair to uh, combat all the flyaways and so that it'll be easier to braid. Okay, so to achieve this look, I'm going to be using some Kanekalon hair that I purchased from the supply store. And I'm just going to be using that large section. So as you can see, I'm going to start braiding my hair um, without the extension. And in this video, um, you kind of get the idea of what I'm trying to achieve, but I ended up making a mistake with starting over. We just want to make sure that the braid is close to the edges of your hair. Just so that you can get enough hair and it'll give it that really nice, natural, kind of like the braid is coming out of your own hair coat. So I'm going to be starting with that small section. And what I'm basically doing is, obviously at the beginning of the video you saw, that I started out braiding my own hair. And then now I'm going to be attaching the extension into the braid as I go along. Almost like you're doing um, single braids, except you've already started braiding your hair. That makes sense. I would have done this with my real hair, I actually started off doing this whole hairstyle with my real hair, but I just like the idea of the extensions and how it just makes it look so thick and full and just really, really nice. So, yeah. Okay, so now I've finally finished one side of my hair. So I'm just going to continue on with the hairstyle for the other side. You pretty much get the idea of what I'm doing anyways. So, yeah. Actually, watching this video over again, I just noticed that I did not moisturize the other side of my hair. <laughs> that is so weird. But, um, yeah, my hair is pretty much moisturized before I started anyways. But yeah, you get the idea. Just pretend that I put the Cantu Shea Moisturizer in my hair. <laughs> so yeah, again, you can see that I attached the um, extensions in as I go along. Same thing as the beginning. And I just keep going down. This side you can see a little bit better than the other side. So now I'm coming to the close of my hairstyle. It's pretty much finished at this point. We don't get the idea of spreading all the way down to Anyways, this is a great protective style for someone who just wants to leave their hair alone for a while, and that's pretty much why I did it. Anyways, I did this part off camera, but what you can do is just cut 
take a pair of scissors and just cut the flyaways away. Anything different into hot water, just give it a little bit more movement. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and make sure you check out my other videos and if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and bye!